In this episode of Quick Tip Tuesday, we take a look at using an animated sprite sheet as part of our particle system in a 2D scene inside of Godot. To start, we'll create a new scene and we'll utilize the GPU particles 2D node. In here, I'll create a new process material shader and inside of this, we'll change some settings here. In my case, turning off gravity and we'll set the emission shape to something like a box. Now, because we're working at a pretty small scale, we'll set it to something like 200 in the X and 100 in the Y. From here, we can take our sprite sheet and drag it into the texture. And right away, we'll notice that it's gonna use the entire sprite sheet as opposed to treating it like an animation. At this point, we'll wanna to go to the canvas item section of our inspector, go to material, and we'll add a new canvas item material. Expanding this out, we'll turn on particle animation, and we have to specify the horizontal and vertical frames for this. Now my sprite sheet has seven horizontal and one vertical, so I can set this to seven here, and it will start to use the animation. Setting this to seven, we might just see the very first frame of our animation be play. So what we'll have to do is scroll back up to our particle process material, and go to the animation and we can specify the min and max speed. So if I set this to one, we'll start to see it come in and we can play with these values to make them either play faster or slower as we go through. At this point, we can start to play with the other settings here and we can set our things like our amounts and the time that they're going to be on screen. 